face. He's a great story for a long time. Just trying to get to the big show. He's a little yes. tr fun trivia fact. He's actually never won the U.S. Nationals, but he's a world champion. Ultimate well, underdog. He's found his way to the big show. Yep. Oh. And he's proved himself time and time. Going to need it with the Algerian attempting world records in the squat. that one like the professional he is yeah it's still pretty smooth making a whole lot of noise once they got here now 282.5 this is going to really give us a good indication if we're starting to feel better yeah. yeah and sometimes a bit of an adrenaline kick all of a sudden the body starts feeling good again into the whole world. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Gives the head nod. Nods his head. And he we got it. So 207.5 kilogram opener. I'm expecting this to move quite quickly. And it does. Ooh, just having a hard time locking out that left arm. And he was but he gets it. 215 kilograms. Oh, he gets it. That looks better than his opener. It looked like not only for that world record, but he's found himself in the middle of the fight of his life with the Algerian. Yeah, this is an important lift. This, uh, this lift keeps him dead even with the Algerian. Missed this lift, and he's finding himself chase having him? to chase him down. And as you would expect from L.S. McLean, he fires when the pressure's on. And Quick little conversation with himself, reaffirming. He's talking himself up a little bit. Gets that to the top. Probably wasn't the smoothest we've seen him lift, but there certainly wasn't any problems with it. Here we go, 312.5. And he'll be followed straight by the Algerian, so we'll know very fast where they're at. Gets it to the top. Yeah, Had to work for it's it. It's worked out, and LS gets it. He's bigger. He's getting stronger. He's got to keep his foot on the gas for this last deadlift. It could be for the overall gold. Wants it and wow. he has it. Is that the checkmate? He just handled that like the 